here in the Middle East, Canadian officials have found it's more difficult than they had expected when it comes to selecting, processing and ultimately transporting thousands of Syrian refugees to Canada. Three charter flights are expected to arrive in Toronto today from the region. And if all goes as planned, that means some 6,000 Syrians will have been resettled by the midnight deadline tonight. Of course, that means Ottawa will have missed its goal by about 40%. We do know that in two of the three countries where Canada is selecting refugees from, things are going relatively well in Jordan and in Lebanon. But Turkey is a different story. I spoke to the Canadian ambassador to Ankara and he says security is a real concern, especially in southern Turkey along the Syrian border where most of the refugees are coming from. It's been difficult to get in there and do interviews and some of the health screening. But they are working on changing that. In the new year, they hope the first flight from Turkey will take off from an airport in that country. But on the overall goal of resettling some 25,000 Syrian refugees by the end of February, the immigration minister, John McCallum, tells me that he's very confident that that deadline will be met. Derek Stoffel, CBC News, Jerusalem.